Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing a Bath and Body Works haul. I did go shopping just a little bit and picked up a few candles and like two other things that are random from there, but fall as you saw in my last video, if you have watched it, fall is my favorite season and like I literally can't stop saying that and I cannot wait for it to be here already. So I did go shopping for some fall candles and some essentials. So if you guys are interested on in seeing my Bath and Body Works haul, then please keep watching. So I did not get a ton of things. I just wanted to get a few essentials and just a few candles that I wanted to stock up on just to get me super excited for fall. Scents to me are amazing. Like I feel like if I could smell it, smelling like fall, it just puts me in the greatest mood ever. So I did just want to get a few of them and they were on sale for $12.50 as opposed to being like $25. So I do want to go ahead and get a few. So we will hop on in. I do have two bags. And yeah, let's get started. And I don't know what it is. I totally felt like super vampy today and just wanted to throw on a bold lip color, a choker, and some camo. So just, just go with the vibe. I don't even know, but I want it to be, I guess, vampy. I'm super excited for fall, if you can't tell. Okay. So the first candle that I picked up is a flannel. Now, I have never got this candle in a full size, I don't think. It just smells so, like, refreshing. It kind of has, like, a little bit of a cranberry scent to it, but I don't think it's, like, overpowering at all. It does have a little bit of a cologne scent to it, which is awesome. So it's, like, a soft, musky smell, if that makes sense. And it has, like mahogany scent to it as well so it's awesome it definitely puts me in the fall vibe it's so cute the packaging has a little leaf on it and it is a flannel on the picture and I don't know it just makes me so happy the color of it and everything super fallish and it just smells like fall I'm awful at describing scents so this entire video is going to be a fail for that but oh my god so good so if you guys are in the need for a new like musky scent candle to put you in the mood Flannel is definitely the way to go. I haven't burnt it yet, but I know that it's gonna be awesome because it just has that scent that I wanted. Like I was going for that scent. So yes, flannel is the first candle I got. There was also a promotion running when I went yesterday where if you were to spend over $10, you get a free item up to like $14. So I did get one of these little candle holders and I think it's super nice and like elegant looking. Very nice like home decor. So I can't wait to like start burning it and put it in there like that. And yeah, like I said, this was free, but I think that they are, yeah, they're $10.50 each. So if you weren't going to get it for the promotion, then $10.50. And I got two of them because I did get um, two orders of things. So yes, really, really cute. And I probably will put them on my desk or on my vanity. Really cute. I actually might give one to my mom because it does match our kitchen decor. So, so the next candle I picked up is called A Thousand Wishes. It's white and it has this such cute, like bubbly purple details on it. I'm a big sucker for packaging, so if it looks cute, home girl is getting it. Like, I love it. Um, I think it'll just look really cute in my room as well. So it smells very, like, festive-y, I want to say. And it has, like, a champagne kind of scent to it. And just, like, really sweet, but not overpowering. Not overpowering at all, which I love, because a lot of candles will give me headaches if they smell too fragrance-like. So, yes. Um, this is also part of their fragrance and body lotion collection, so they did make it into a candle form. And I'm so excited when they have like collections like this coming out into candles because if you can wear it on your body and smell nice, why not make it a candle form, right? So yeah, Thousand Wishes, super excited that I got this. This is my first time getting this one and I'm super excited to start burning it. The next two items are little gifts that I got from my friend last week for my birthday. So Steph, if you're watching, thank you so much. Shout out to you. Um, she knows me oh so well and she got me a Marshmallow Fireside little candle. It looks like this in the mason jar. I am obsessed with the details on this. It's so cute. They change them up every year. So I have my old one sitting right there and it definitely is different. I mean, the color of it being gray is the same, but it's just so cute. It has a little mug on the cap and a fireside burning. I don't know. I just love it. So, yes, we got this one. And then we also got the Sleep Aromatherapy Lotion and then Body Wash. So, I have this lotion, and it always sits right beside me by my bed. And I always put it on, like, every single night. It just so, this is Lavender Vanilla, and what it's supposed to do is help calm you down and just, like, relieve stress and kind of get your mindset into, like, going to sleep. Lavender is really calming, so that's what that does. And I like to believe that if I'm putting this on my hands and my body every night, it's just going to put me to sleep. So... It doesn't really do that, but obviously, like, I like putting it on. I love the smell of it, and it is the aromatherapy from Bath & Body Works. So it's still in the packaging, but it is amazing. If you guys are looking for, like, a body lotion that smells like a baby, 
like lavender, uh, definitely go for this one. It's super awesome. And so we stocked up on this one, and then we have the body wash, which I'm really excited to try out because I've been using this for about a year and I haven't used the body wash yet. So I'm really excited to go ahead and use that. I will probably use it only like towards nighttime, so it'll like, again, help calm me down, get me ready for bed, and just feel really soothing and calming. So yeah, that's gonna be good for nighttime. So it came in this little, little pack, and yeah, again, thank you so much to my friend. Then I also had to pick up another Marshmallow Fireside in a bigger candle form, the Three Wick one, because I can just never have enough. This is my all-time favorite scent from Bath & Body Works, so it was a given that I was going to be getting another one. I am obsessed. It literally smells like marshmallows burning. It just smells like s'mores. It's just awesome. It gets me in the mood for almost winter, which is my second favorite season, so yes. I'm just super excited for everything. The holidays, everything. I'm really early, but... If you guys don't know what this smells like, I cannot explain scents through virtually, so this kind of sucks, but it's just toasted marshmallow, smoldering woods, and fire roasted vanilla, and crystallized amber, so that is what it smells like, so if you could put that all into one, so, so, so good, so I'm really excited that I have now two of them. Next candle I picked up is this Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte, so anything marshmallow is what my eye attracts, or my nose attracts to, I guess. I love the scent of marshmallow, I love marshmallows in general, so... When I saw that it was a pumpkin latte, I was like, oh, hold on a second. It smells so good. It smells like a latte. It's a lot sweeter than I thought it was gonna be when I first opened it, but it smells so yummy. It kind of smells like vanilla cookies, but a little hint of marshmallow in there, so I don't really know where the pumpkin is because I don't really smell that, but it's awesome. It smells so nice and definitely will put me into the spirits of fall. So yeah, I wanted to try out this one. The one that I really should have gotten that I didn't get was Sweater Weather. I love that one, but I do have one sitting right over there that's still being used, so I figured why not, why, why get it if I'm still burning one? But I definitely need to stock up on that one soon too. So these are just a little bit of things that I needed to get to kind of start me off for fall, but I know I will make another trip there very soon. <laughs> and then the last thing that I picked up from Bath & Body Works is not a candle, but it is this Two Time Supreme Lip Shine. Lip Shine Juicy Jazz, aka Jasmine, my girl, got me onto that, and it is awesome. It literally just moisturizes your lips, but it's also kind of like a lip gloss, so it'll make them look super duper juicy and full and amazing. It does have mint to it, so it'll also cure your lips if they're chapped or anything like that, and it just feels really nice, smells really nice, and looks great on the lips, so I needed to pick up another one of those because I did finish it. So those are all the items that I picked up from Bath & Body Works. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Maybe found it a little helpful if you guys are going to Bath & Body Works or if you guys have any candles that you like from Bath & Body Works, let me know down below what your favorite scent is. It doesn't have to be from Bath & Body Works, whether it be Yankee Candle or any name brand. Let me know down below what your favorite scent is. Right now, mine has to be the Marshmallow Fireside or anything marshmallow e scenty like that or like a cologne scent is my number one. And I think that is it for this video. I will see you guys in my next one. Bye!